Lesson 4, series type, example 4. Prove by induction that x plus x cubed plus x to the power 5 plus all the way along to x to the 2n minus 1 is equal to x outside of x to the 2n minus 1 all over x plus 1 times x minus 1 for positive integral of n greater than or equal to 1. Now, for n equals 1, the left hand side is obviously just x. The right hand side will be equal to x outside of x squared minus 1 over x plus 1 times x minus 1. Now this is x squared minus 1, so this will cancel with this, and we get x. Therefore, the left hand side is equal to the right hand side. Therefore, this statement. is true for n is equal to 1. Now we'll assume that the statement is true for n, for n equals k. That is, x plus x cubed plus x to the power of 5 plus all the way along to x to the 2k minus 1 equals x outside of x to the 2k minus 1 all over x plus 1 times x minus 1. That's our assumption statement. Now we have to prove it true for n equals k plus 1. Now, prove this statement is true for n equals k plus 1. That is, x plus x cubed plus x to the power of 5 plus x to 2k minus 1 plus, now putting k plus 1 here, you get x to the 2k plus 1 is equal to x outside of x to the 2k plus 2 minus 1 all over x plus 1 times x minus 1. And that's our proof statement here. So I'll add x to 2k plus 1 to both sides of A. So we get x plus x cubed plus x to the power of 5 plus x to the 2k minus 1. Now I'll just put this in different color plus different color. Right. Plus x to the 2k plus 1 equals x outside of x to 2k minus 1 over x plus 1, x minus 1, plus x to 2k plus 1. Again, you can see the assumption statement in white, and I've added the yellow to both sides, which makes this left-hand side the same as that one. So now it is required to prove to prove that x outside of x to 2k minus 1 over x plus 1, x minus 1, plus x to 2k plus 1 
is equal to x outside of x the 2k plus 2 minus 1 all over x plus 1 times x minus 1. Okay, so I've written out the left-hand side. Now we need to put this over a common denominator, which you know is x squared minus 1. So we'll write that as x outside of x the 2k minus 1 plus x the 2k plus 1 times x squared minus 1 all over. And we'll leave this one as it is, x plus 1 x minus 1. Okay. Right, now we'll just um, this stage we'll take out the x and x as a common factor. So there'll be an x in here and an x in there. And we'll leave an x outside of x to 2k minus 1 plus x to the 2k and x squared minus 1. Did you see that little that little 1's gone? It's gone out here. All over x plus 1, x minus 1. The reason I did that is because there was an x out there. So I needed an x outside. So hopefully this will all come back to this. Let's have a look. Okay, and that equals x outside of x to 2k minus 1. You've always got to be looking back at what you've got to prove. Otherwise, you're going to, you might go down the wrong pathway. And this is plus x to the 2k plus 2 minus x to the 2k. All over. And I think you can see it now, can't you? x plus 1, x minus 1. And of course that is x outside of x to the 2k plus 2, because these ones cancel out, minus 1. OK, which is what you had to prove. Over x plus 1 times x minus 1, which equals the right hand side of p. OK, so I've written out the standard line. Therefore, the statement is true for n equals k plus 1. Now, the statement is true for n equals 1. So by mathematical induction, the statement is true for all integral values of n greater than or equal to 1.